Oh, it's, yeah, it's going to look really nice here. Like all the all the backgrounds look really pretty. And the foregrounds, obviously. The foregrounds <laughs> and the backgrounds, everything <laughs> goes without saying. A community day is a day where we, we get one day a month where we can choose what we do and we help different communities and help with different charities and do things that we're passionate about. So today we've come to Whitcourt Farm, which is part of Farms for City Children. It's a charity that help deprived children. They come from the cities and they come and look at the farm and they explore the great outdoors. We really focus on children who wouldn't have this experience if they've got, a, you know, they live in an urban area. That's quite a unique experience for them that they may never have been able to experience other than through this charity. They keep us entertained, keep us fed, and it's a nice excuse to come out into the countryside and, yeah, get mucky. <laughs> Today we are helping to paint the dormitories which is where the kids come for their residential stays. They stay from a Monday to a Friday and so we want to make sure they've got a really nice place that they can rest and relax when they come back from their days of helping out on the farm just like we are. Last time I was here we were helping with the gardening and I helped construct the polytunnel over there and it's great to be back here again now and to see the progress that has gone on and it just looks like it's come together so well and and the kids they must absolutely love it Tyler Grange has been a fantastic partner for Whitcourt and Farms for City Children. Days like today where they bring lots of people power and we can get jobs done that we just can't do as a small staff team. So, you know, decimating gardens where we need to create places to grow things, um, painting, sanding, cleaning. So they bring lots of people power, which is fantastic. But they also bring specialist professional advice. So we've been wandering around today with some of the ecologists and looking about how we can make gains for biodiversity across the site. So that specialist advice is really important to Whitcourt as well. Oh wow. Can I go right in, Stevie? I've been here at times when children aren't here and when they are here. And I have to say, seeing, seeing it when the children are here, you just it really brings home what an important charity it is and how um, you know, some kids just they don't even know what a cow looks like. They've never seen a green field, they've never seen stars. So it's just, yeah, it's amazing to be able to help them out. I've spent other community days doing personal stuff with me, so I've spent it with the Somerset Wildlife Trust, uh, Somerset Environmental Records Centre, I spend a lot of time volunteering with them, I've got a, far, a farm in Froome, Somerset, um, that I do camera trapping and volunteering with them, so I've been out and about quite a bit with my using my community days with my normal volunteering stuff, yeah. It's not very often that you are able to volunteer during um, the working week. Um, so to have the opportunity to come and do something like this, it's, yeah, it's very enriching, um, very rewarding experience. Obviously living in Manchester, the hustle and the bustle, and there's not that much greenery, it's super, super nice to come down, chill out and see everyone in the Cotswolds. It's great to do your job, but it's good to help other people and coming here and doing something different to what we're used to doing every single day uh, really makes you feel like you're making a good impact on the, on the rest of society. It does change people's lives, we, we know that. There's quite a lot of people who are famous now who you know, talk about their experience of coming to Whitcourt and the other farms. And we have a lot of supporters who used to come here when they were children. And so they, they tell us that it, it has changed lives, it has impacted on their lives. And we know that it has a really um, positive impact on well-being. You know, the children talk about that as well, about feeling calmer. We know that animals can be therapeutic to children. And so we, yeah, that's something that's really special about Farms and City Children. It really is part of our purpose to help um, our communities and, and it's, I think it's, it's fairly rare. I know some businesses do things like corporate responsibility days, but it, this feels very ingrained in our purpose as a business. It's not um, a token 
effort to do charitable work. Um, people are really passionate about it and it's one of the huge draws. One, it was one of the huge draws for me uh, 11, 12 years ago to um, come and work for Tyler Grange because of that. Working for Tyler Grange, I've only been here for two months, but it's honestly been the best two months of any job I've had. Everyone is so kind, welcoming. You really feel like part of a family. And coming and doing days like this just makes everyone bond closer and just have a really, really great time. It's just a brilliant, brilliant company to work for, and I absolutely love it.